Hi there. In this video, you learn how to add a master text frame to your advantage. So let's get started. Let's first go to layout and margins and columns and increase the number of columns to two and reduce the gutter to P7 and hit OK. Suppose we need a page per topic. So instead of typing in the title in each page and setting its font and font size individually, won't it be better to have a template set on the master page? So let's double click a master and grab the text tool and make a text box on top, right about this size. Let's add the text in design training topic one. Now we can style it. So let's change the font to one of my favorite fonts, Poppins Bold. Also increase the size to 30 points and then center align it. Well, this is the horizontal center alignment, but our text is still not vertically center aligned to the text box. So grab the selection tool and you shall find that option here on top. Just click it once and the text will be center aligned vertically as well. Since this is a master A element, it will now show on every page. So you don't have to bother typing in the topic on every page. All you need to do is change the topic number. Let's go to page two and change the topic number here. I hope you remember the shortcut to override the master page settings. You learned it in the last one. It's shift command on a Mac or shift control on a PC and then click the text box and it shall override the master settings. Now you can make your changes and then move on to the next page to make it topic three. So this is something that can help ease your work and make you more efficient. All right, guys, that's another short one and it's time to grab a cup of coffee and I shall see you in the next one. Goodbye.